Hello and welcome to Judo Sage Academy's YouTube channel. We have a very important announcement for candidates preparing for A Lit PG 2024 examination. The pattern for A Lit PG has been very recently changed, and now there's a new pattern for this exam. Uh, please note that A Lit PG has changed its pattern before as well. So make sure that when you're preparing for this exam, you are up to date with the changes that have happened in the pattern. So let's see uh, what are these changes. and how are they different from the earlier pattern which was there up until 2023 so sabse pehle we will also look at the dates because applications has opened for alet pg as well uh, from 7th august onwards you can apply till 13th november 2023 the admit card will be issued on 20th november and the alet exam is on 10th december 2023 now let's come to the changes that have happened so first of all uh, now the alet pg exam will only be mcq based earlier there were subjective questions as well but now they will only have mcq questions so the test will have 100 mcqs carrying one mark each now all these mcqs will be from different branches of law so there will be no questions from english as there were earlier and the duration of the exam is 120 minutes Let's look at the official notification. So you can see that the entrance exam is going to be only MCQ based now from 2024. This will contain 100 MCQs of one mark each, and all 100 MCQs will be from the legal portion only because earlier there were questions from English as well, but now they have included only questions from law, and it will be a 120 minute exam, and there is a 0.25 negative marking in this exam. Now let's quickly take a look at the old pattern as well. So this was the pattern up until 2023. In 2023 also they did some minor changes in the pattern. So earlier the total marks for this paper were 150 and the duration was 90 minutes. So the exam was actually uh, very short on time. You can look at the pattern as well. Earlier they also asked English. So there were 25 questions of one mark each for English. there were legal reasoning questions so 25 questions of two marks each were from legal reasoning and the third portion was subjective answer writing so there were two questions of total 75 marks each so you can see that this was a very substantially different pattern than what they have changed it to now let's see whether it is a good thing that the pattern has changed or not so earlier the drawback the major drawback was that it it used to be a very lengthy paper because uh there were mcqs from english and law and law also from legal reasoning so legal reasoning is time consuming because it takes time for you to apply the concept and then select the right option it is not as simple as solving mcqs direct mcqs at least and the subjective part made it even more lengthy and difficult because it did take a lot of time to write good subjective answers but now only legal questions are going to be asked in an mcq format there is no english portion and no subjective question so the change pattern is good and it is less time consuming and now that only mcqs from law are going to be asked so if you are preparing for clat pg cuet or any other llm entrance exam then you don't have to put in any additional effort to crack a lit pg and just with the right guidance and right mock test you can crack a lit pg very easily so good luck for your exam and if you have any doubts or question you can leave them in the comment section If you like this video please like and share and subscribe to our YouTube channel